Hello, hello, and welcome back to Leaky Gaming, and welcome back to another episode of Workers and Resources Soviet Republic Christmas Edition. <laughs> welcome back to another episode of World Building Series. Right, okay, uh, of course, Merry Christmas, everybody. Uh, these are still kind of breaking through. This is one of the reasons uh, um, if Equinox Nova is watching this, uh, you have these. I don't think, I don't know if it's even possible to make this function properly, but you can see here the square, how it's uh, going through, how the, the textures are disappearing. It's probably due to, I don't know if it's in my settings maybe, but... Um, Loading distance or something like that uh, could be, but I think I have everything on the very high grass details. I can do these uh, just in a little bit more detail. I, I should have a decent PC for running this. Anyway, Christmas lights. Yep, the uh, wealthier. I promised him we're gonna do this, but unfortunately, I I didn't do it. How do you do this? Right, 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 right. So we need Christmas lights. There we go. Uh, perfect, perfect. Red ones here. We're gonna have a couple of them from building to building. Perfect. Can we do the uh, from here to... Oh, we can't. Oh, where is it? Come on, come on, come on, you bastard. It was there for a second. Okay, for some reason doesn't allow us here. Looks like I didn't even realize this, but this is better than I expected. The, the They are actually recognizing these pillars as a solid objects. This is quite, quite nice. I like this. Uh, a little bit of green ones. Let's go for... Oh, colored ones. I didn't even notice those. What's this? Christmas lights. It just says Christmas lights. Am I supposed to be using them different way? I mean, like, it's working... Uh, what are all these different ones here? This is just different lights. Ah, right, okay. Okay, I, I don't get it. I don't get the part where I'm supposed to... Be. Oh, it's snowing! <laughs> Perfect. It's 23rd November. Happy... Merry Christmas. Happy Christmas. Whatever you say. Wherever you come from. Anyway. I mean, we, we have several Christmas. I'm going to say, like, uh, I saw an advertisement for... For Russia these days, not these days, like a couple of, like a decade ago or something, like, oh, the country that actually celebrates, celebrates Christmas two times. Yeah, Orthodox one or, or uh, well, not Orthodox one, the one that is Gregorian calendar and Julian calendar, or what's it called? Calendars. Anyway, uh, we're going to do a little bit of decorating in whale tier, and uh, <clears throat> we're going to go back to the, ooh, look at these. There we go, something like this, a little bit of uh, different lights. These. There we go. I think this is quite nice. Yeah, that was a good idea. I didn't expect it's gonna be such a nice idea, so thank you, Wiltir, for forcing me to do this. Uh, uh, these lights are quite, quite nice. I love them. <coughs> uh, can we do that? We can go all the way up. And a little bit over here. Uh, different lights. Green ones? Sure, sure, sure. There we go, perfect. Can we do it on the floor? No, it has to be kind of building related. Okay, that's fine. I won't I won't put <clears throat> any more here. And of course, we're going to go and jump to Galask and see what we're doing there. I wanted to check a little bit of um, the, how, how did we set up the things that we set up. Uh, our industry is functioning. We are still in the world building mode, so there's no issues. Ooh, these two. These two are nice. <clears throat> Red ones, yellow ones. There we go. A little bit. Ooh, 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 ooh. Um, sure, sure, sure. How are we gonna connect this? From pedestal? Or should we do it from the... Something like this. Perfect. <laughs> Uh, Ulyanov here. Uh, right, right. Um, uh, I'm, I'm gonna leave it alone now. Okay, what I wanted to check in this one, I wanted to check everything, how it's functioning. Maybe a little bit of city building. I think we said in the last one we're gonna fix something. No, no, that was the burnt warehouse that we connected and, well, kind of, it's fixed. Ooh, we probably lost a lot of steel there. 
Yeah, probably with it. Probably with it. What's with the trains? Let's see here. Trains are delivering coal and coal. Okay, so this is a problem. We have two trains delivering coal and coal. So the iron ones are not uh, arriving here. What the hell are you doing? This one is loading steel. Where the hell is this guy going? That's interesting. Uh, what I wanted to do here is uh, let me go and tell this one to go here. <clears throat> this is this is a little bit of a problem because the only consumption of uh, that we have over here is oh, they have iron as well. Oh, I didn't expect they're going to be working so productively. That's fine. That's fine. Let them work. Uh, finances, finances. So we have exports versus imports. Of course, we are building a lot. So uh, the only thing that I'm interested in is exports. So let's see. Uh, let's see all. So we only started exporting properly uh, this month and last month, I believe. Uh, it's a little bit longer. You can see here that we have uh, 300,000. What did we export? Coal, a little bit. Yeah, steel would be the, the biggest one. Really? We're exporting uh, power? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that's actually fine. Iron, that's uh, noted. We, we need a lot of iron exports. This is the, the, the main thing we have. But uh, let's see. Uh, this is coal. This is iron. Okay. And I don't know what the hell this guy is doing and why is he... Ah! Right, right, right. He doesn't have a second uh, place to go. So can you go... <clears throat> uh, he needs to go there and he's finding the quickest location just to go where he's supposed to go. That would be in this direction. <clears throat> you can see here that we have this coal guy here. I, I want to leave him alone. I want to leave this coal train alone. Uh, this guy, can you turn around? Uh, I think you can. Yeah, he can't. He can then rejoin the... Uh, where are you supposed to go? go? Go here. Go here. Go there and wait until loaded with steel. Go and wait until loaded with steel and then unload steel there. So he can switch straight away. This is this burnt down. We rebuilt it, so it's fine. And uh, now it's functioning. The problem here we have is this little coal train. We have two coal trains and at one point, well, almost uh, always we're going to have two coal trains at the same time and we're not consuming so much coal. So one of each would be better. So I'm going to pay a little bit more attention to this and remove this train as soon as possible. Maybe I should remove it. I'm just a cheapskate. This is the reason why I'm doing this. Just just a cheapskate because I want to use all the coal from here. This is the only reason. In the meantime, I'm going to play with Wealthier a little bit. Let's see these buses that are delivering. Ooh, look at this. They're full. Okay. Uh, we're missing technical services. Uh, let's go with those. So, road. And we're going to go for technical services. Uh, technical. Technical services. I think I'm going to go for the biggest ones over here. Because this is the... Ooh. Okay, I thought there was like street lights here. No, that's a, just power cable, electricity hoses. Um, what about here? I think this is not a bad place for it. Uh, sure, sure. Let's build one of these. Let's finish it off and uh, I will populate it so we can start cleaning the area here. Uh, all around here. Uh, workers. I think we have a lot of workers delivered. I think it's only slow now because of the... Let's see. All of these people. Buses are full. Okay, uh, this is a perfect time for us to go and check Christmas. What the hell? They're not lit. Okay, let's see. Let's see in uh, in uh, Murmansk over here. I don't know what you can see, guys, but uh, <laughs> it looks interesting. Really, at night the lights are not on. I'm gonna pause this for a second, just a second, because I'm surprised about this. Why don't we have lights during the night? Uh, let's try to place new lights. Oh, they're lit. Okay, they are lights. Well, what was wrong with... Uh... Oh, yeah, there's no lights. Look at these. Some of them are on, some of them are off. And the electricity is supplied. You can see that every other light is working. So I have no idea why some lights are on, some are off. Huh. I have no idea. What's with these guys? Uh, trains delivering people. That's perfect. Okay, let's play around a little bit. Let me show you what I uh, what I uh, wanted to uh, make around here. These Sarajevo buildings. Let's see how far from the train station we can build here. Uh, this is almost all the way gone. I think nice neighborhood can be uh, placed around here. Okay, McKay. Um, 
do I have to flatten it? I don't know. Uh, I'm going to try to use... I, I'm not going to use the red square here just as... A, Oh, technical services. Okay, let's go with technical services first. Here I will go for something a little bit more simpler. Uh, garbage office, right? Sure, sure, sure. Garbage office. Uh, yeah, actually, this is quite important. This one here, garbage office. Uh, maybe I don't want to build so close to the railroad because who knows what kind of expansions we're gonna we can expect. Oh, what the hell is this? Maybe there's, I don't know what this is, F2, F3? Maybe the pipes are going out of ground here, so this is why it's not along. It doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. Let's, oh, I didn't populate the, 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 the first one. Let's go with a couple of trucks. One, two, three, four, uh, three kilometers, that's fine. Just clean everything up. Uh, whale tier, we're going to do the same thing over here. Are people okay? Looks like they are. I think we're missing city hall in office building okay perfect we're missing city hall in the um in murmansk so what i'm gonna do is this technical services no this is fire station we can do technical services uh here right next to it uh technical services a little bit um, <laughs> which ones let's go for this one this time this is a little bit um, i don't want to build the newest ones the the uh, the badia 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 that's all, folks. Uh, I don't want to build the biggest ones from um, Rob's because they are a little bit too modern for this time. Actually, we don't even know what time we're going to start this because I might edit the, the date here before we start actually, you know, making this, you know, working on this. Um, do you have? They have. Do you guys? You don't have. These guys don't have. They don't have. Uh, this is the last one. One, two, three, four, four. Let's go with six. That's fine. It's a little bit bigger area, but hey ho. Um, they should have all the fuel, everything that they need, and uh, yeah, that's about it. Okay, uh, what can I do? I can have some coffee. Right, so coffee done. Uh, we're going to build a new neighborhood over here. We're going to build a new neighborhood in, um, uh, in Murmansk. I'm going to try to make something like this, but, 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 I will not um, level the whole area like I did here. If you, s if you check here, I level the whole area and then build a square. I mean, first buildings, but then square. I won't do it now because I won't be building red square, which requires really, really, really flat ground. I will go for uh, the same neighborhood, same buildings. I think they should be around here. Let me just see. Uh, are they smallest buildings? Uh, they could be. They are here. There we go. Uh, I like that uh, Equinox Nova, and this is for all motors. If anybody is looking at um, at this, uh, just a heads up. Um, uh, I I like. I personally suggest that you make your mods special. These uh, slots, these things. Like for example, um, the, the the icons. Why? Because for example, here you have Equinox Nova. I can recognize which mods are his by the red uh, square around the mod. And you have Rob's ones with the sigil of the city, where the buildings are located in real life uh, that's a really really cool one i think that's the num my favorite you have a comrade joe with a little um uh, stevie stewie sorry stevie stewie from uh, family guy but it's uh, a comrade joe stewie and uh, i a little bit harder to to check it out is these hand um, chris's chris has high quality icons here but unfortunately you can't properly even read what is on the screen here uh you can distinguish them how they look like but it's a little bit harder to uh, uh to recognize it and th there's nothing uh, picture doesn't tell me anything because it's really hard to, to you know you have to read what a, a mod is but chris has really high quality screenshots here anyway we're gonna go for Equinox Nova's um, building, Sarajevo buildings here. Uh, I will go for overground. This is the under dug in or underground one. I will go combination of these three buildings. Uh, I'm gonna go for F2. I will require a little bit of flat ground, flat earth, flat ground uh, here for the neighborhood. So we're gonna go and build j just this. Ooh. Feel the burn. Uh, this actually doesn't look bad. If I if I do this, 
Uh, right. Um, this is this is one of the problems, or maybe even a solution to one of the problems that I usually see in this game. Like, where do you level? Where do you choose to level? Because if you level all of it here, look, suddenly you get uh, a little bit of dip over here. Usually, my suggestion is if you want to, <coughs> excuse me, if you want to level this properly, uh, do it uh, regard like uh, choose a size of a building. For example, here uh, uh, we we can build this one over here. For example, but if you want to uh, build everything to look a little bit like a, a nice, to look nice, level only the area around the building, and that's it. Uh, this is a little bit problematic building because it has. I can I can do it like this. Let's go because it has uh, this flat flat part of the building it looks like it's supposed to have a back to back on some other building or something but i'm gonna do it like this i'm gonna do two of these let's see if i can make them fit here uh, okay this is gonna be a little bit harder than i expected Back to back. Uh, is this gonna look nice? Let's see how it fits together. Um, looks like it is a little bit... Uh, I want to say good, but let's see how it looks like. Uh, it's not bad. I mean, these balconies here, I don't even know what this is supposed to be. It looks like it should be a balcony. Um, uh, there, are, there are real buildings, real life buildings here as well, so... Uh, but it's fine. I think it's fine. So this is one of the buildings that I'm gonna build. Uh, I will... You know what? I, I found that this... I like kind of this that I... That, oh, yeah, right. Usually, how would you build buildings like this? I would suggest doing this. Now, next building uh, should have level. Again, try to level it uh, regarding the road. This is some of the fixed things that you're not going to change that often. So, for example, we can do this. And then we can go for a next neighborhood. Or next building, sorry. Uh, Juro Djakovic housing. Uh, back to the main road. Why the hell not? You can do it in this direction as well. Uh, so they can look, uh, balconies can be towards the roads, but maybe it's better like this, you know, when the kids play, usually they should be playing on the roads. I remember me growing up in the city of Split in the, in the Croatian coast. Growing up, I was spending summers there because I had some family. Um, and uh, you, uh, there was like Split 3, number 3, it's called the neighborhood. It has a lot of brutalist buildings and uh, it was a dense neighborhood there. So um, I, I, uh, there was a lot of, a lot of uh, places to play. Uh, around there and I quite enjoyed uh, visiting my, my family there and uh, it was really really cool it, it looks really really cool even now if you go to split 3 uh, if you try to search on google maps you can see the whole neighborhood there uh, third building uh, is going to be what these. It doesn't have connect. Um, it's not. It's dug in building, so it's going to only partially be above ground. I'm hoping that you know it's uh, realistic somewhat because it, it does have um, a few like uh, 41 people, 42 people living in here. I don't know why it's like <clears throat> why we have odd numbers of uh, people living in the buildings. For example. Will I have an example? Five, for example. Usually we have a man and a woman, man and a man, woman and a woman. How you do it? A uh, woman and a woman living together is fine, but you know, like to have a family, uh, but a single person. Uh, okay, uh, look at this. This is a little bit of a problem. Um, it is all on the flat ground, but this one is a little bit, looks like it's levitating. So can I fix this? Um, what's with this building? Let's, uh, let's remove it. <clears throat> and see if I can level this up, or level this a little bit more. I can, I can try to build this same <laughs> building. Is it this one? Uh, yeah, this is the building. But um, a little bit on the flat earth ground, flat earth ground. Uh, I, ooh. Oh, right, it doesn't have any collisions. Yeah, this is the problem. Uh, it's not a problem. I love it that it doesn't have collisions, but I will uh, pause this and just try to um, make this look a little bit nicer, not to levitate in the air. So the suggestion, guys, whenever you're dealing with non-collision buildings, uh, I think I'm going to go with this smaller building. That's 28 people, am I correct? Uh, yeah, 28 people. Uh, smaller building. Uh, we need to level this area and uh, ta -dum, ta -dum. Uh, let's go like this. Okay, I I think that's that's enough. And then smaller building uh, like this, but I would like it to be on the perfectly flat ground. It still looks like it's gonna be levitating in the air for some reason. Uh, Equinox Nova, if you're watching this. 
Let's see. Let's see uh, if I can I can play around with this, or I can I can I can stutter. No, it's um, uh, if I uh, find the flat. Yeah, it's these ones. Yeah, you can see that it it, it kind of le is it levitating. I think it is. I think it's levitating a little bit uh, building uh, so i think uh, some of these buildings especially the ones without collision uh you guys can put them uh you can put them to be uh underground a little bit like a few centimeters and then they would fit perfectly because these are levitating above ground these not because uh really i would build this one on the uh, Maybe they're not. Maybe they're not. Anyway, um, the three buildings like this, we are increasing population of Murmansk. And we have a neighborhood over here. So we're going to have a nice square here. A square. It's going to be like just a, a you know fountain and stuff. Uh, we're going to build some footpaths. Actually, it's a little bit on the steep side here. Will we be able to build footpaths? I, I can do this. I know how to do this. You don't have to. Don't judge me. Like this. I don't want to... I, I was thinking of making uh, underpasses. Maybe we can construct this later on our own. But uh, I don't want to do it right now. Can we do this? Can we please? Please? No? Yeah, it looks like it's... Um, the, this little steep part over here is causing some issues. Uh, there we go. Uh, usually you can resolve this by just moving this. You can see that the angled one, it per works perfectly fine angles angles ones uh what about here what about here what about here maybe i should maybe i should build it angled uh maybe a cross like this christmas cross cross something this there we go and we can have some kind of square over here i'll build a footpath all the way I think here, just so we have some kind of guidance. Uh, it looks a little bit wonky. Actually, it doesn't. I think it uh, looked fine. Let, let's rebuild it. So from here, uh, I was thinking of... Yeah. Look, I, I thought this is a little bit... Yeah, it's like angled towards the... This looks... Look, look how this uh, upper part... Like, it looks pretty nice. And then, bang, horrible. Here, horrible. So what I'm going to do here is... Can we level this? No. No right-click leveling. That's fine. And then correct it. Uh, it doesn't. It looks horrible. Uh, look, when I try to build it, it looks fine. But when I need to connect it, it looks horrible. Okay, but let's build it this way. Let's build it this way. Okay. Did I say that? Let's build it this way. Yeah, I did. Um... Something nice here, uh, monument, yes, 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 monument, something small, uh, small monument, what can we build here as a monument, let's go for Kru Khrushchev, Spominik? yeah, well, I'm gonna do this, this is also Equinox Nova's monuments, I didn't subscribe to all of them, I really, really need to do that, he has all the, like, perfect, beautiful, brutalist, uh, monuments for, for you know, uh, partisan uprisings and uh, liberation of the... I, I think he might have even Yasanovats, the dead camp that uh, uh, not Croatian Nazis had in the during the war, but that's a subject for uh, other time. Fountain... Uh, fountains are fine. Oh, they even influence the loyalty, really? Fountains influence their loyalty. But there be fountains. Uh... Okay, um, I'm fine with this. Let's build a fountain, and I would like to continue then uh, with these footpaths. Like the can I? Can I? Uh, I would obviously like to have a footpath in this in this direction, and then continuing. It doesn't matter where it continues. We'll we'll work with, on this, and there we go. Three-way uh, monument, perfect. And then I would like to have some residential buildings here. Uh, this is not too steep of a slope. I don't think these uh, small buildings that are angled, like a slope build, actually, hmm, interesting. Uh, feng Shui, form over function. Uh, the balconies are a problem here. If we build these buildings, uh, we need to have balconies in the right place. So I think this is... Let's try it this way. 
What I'm saying here is if you have halfway sticking out balconies, that's not good. That's not going to look nice. Uh, it has to be kind of placed in a perfect way order. I wouldn't be <clears throat> I wouldn't be against it if these um, if these uh, buildings had less population, uh, it would look nice. You can see here, you can see that there's something on the ground here, but at least balconies are clean. Now, what I mean by clean, uh, some of these balconies, when you have non-collision buildings, they can have dirt, snow uh, there. It can be done better in the editor, but I'm going to leave it like this for now. Uh, right. Um, so usually I would make a square red one like here, but I think I'm going to go for something more traditional. Uh, gravel is my thing to go, but I will just give it a go with... I, I absolutely hate it. I absolutely hate both this asphalt thing and I hate the the, um, the airplane strip thing. I, I hate both of those. They look um, <clears throat> so sterile. They look so bad. Um, it's not good. Like I just don't think they fit here. It's not like that they look bad. They're designed exactly how they should be designed, but they don't fit here. The, the gravel is my, uh, you know, thing to go. Um, and then we can do a little bit like more like this. Something like this, and we need to finish it off. Uh, I think gravel is the best one here. Well, what the hell is this? Um, all the way. I think that's fine. Just, just level all of all of this area here. I, I'll build a, you know, a surrounding. Whoa, they can walk there now. Okay, that, that, that's fine. I'm fine with this fountain. Uh, not working during the winter. Not working during the winter. And the last thing I would like to do here is. something like this I will I will work on this and make it a little bit nicer now it's a little bit sterile like I said there's not a lot of stuff happening here but I would like to make it um, make something for example I think we have these shops uh, shops being the kiosks small ones uh, alcohol wise I don't know I'm not too impressed about that I don't want to create you know some kind of dystopia or whatever uh, maybe some people want us to build that, but uh, I would like to make this area nice. Um, we have a couple of kiosks. Uh, we have kiosks, bazaars here. I don't know if this is the best. No, no, no. no. I just wanted to like make a nice like newsstand. Um, prefab grocery. Uh, what I should do around here is this one. That would be... I, I think I'm going to have to build another building around here. Oh, this uh, tram bar here. Oh, that's nice. I, I didn't... I should probably connect this one. Ooh, we can connect all of this. I think this is okay. This is okay. They can enter here. Uh, I would like to build a shop um, like uh, Equinox Nova's shop, like this one here. This one, uh, again, it has to be placed on perfectly uh, flat terrain, flat earth terrain. Um, maybe we can do it like this. It has entrance to the building this way. That's a little bit weird. But we can uh, build it like this. Or, or maybe even like this. Uh, the, the unfortunate part is that the entrance to the shop is in this direction. So it's going to look a little bit wrong. We can do it like this, can we? Uh, yeah, like I said, it's not perfectly flat here. So it's uh, a little bit... Uh, looks a little bit weird. But we can do it, make it part of this building, for example. I think it would look nice over here. The problem with this building, let me show you what the problem is. Um, well, maybe it's not going to be a problem. Uh, <clears throat> they will have entrance to the building here, no issues. Yeah, actually, it looks okay. I think it looks okay. The only problem is the, well, the only problem is that I need to connect it to the main road. And, oh, I can. Perfect. Okay, I thought it was going to be these paths and stuff that is going to be in the way, but uh, I think this is okay. So, uh, something like this, and now we have additional shop. Perfect. Uh, the only thing we have to do is supply them with stuff, with crap. Uh, crap being uh, food, let's go with covered hull, uh, and we need meat, but meat is going to be used from another shop, so uh, that's fine. We have here, load food, and then go here, oh, no, here, deliver food. Perfect. We can have dedicated this one here, just in case we have a little bit too many 
uh, customers or something. Uh, sorry, if I have too much food, that's fine. And then the second one would be here. We're gonna steal it from over here. <clears throat> that would be this one. And we can add a second location. That's gonna be unloading and perfect. Off you go. Uh, he's not waiting to be unloaded, so he's gonna supply both of them with meat. And we supply more than we need. So there we go. Um, that's about it. This is what I wanted to leave it as uh, this Christmas. So I would say, guys, um, Merry Christmas, Happy Christmas. I hope you're having a good one. Uh, I'm gonna continue having a nice one i had a nice time yesterday with the missus and playing some games and you know it was, it was quite colorful i'm gonna stuff my face like a musket today again with something like uh francuska salata french salad we call it in the balkans uh it's actually something mixture it's similar to the russian salad or something like that we're gonna be making homemade one i haven't made that in a while it's with mayonnaise uh, potatoes, cooked potatoes, cooked beer, uh, uh, peas, cooked carrots, and this kind of stuff. I might post photos on the Discord, so if you're a member of Discord, you might see it. If not, if I don't, I don't. <laughs> we'll see how it's gonna go. I'm still gonna work on this square a little bit to increase population of this area. Uh, initially, I would like to create more living space for people. You can see that uh, Galask, sorry, that Murmansk is doing really, really, really well. Um, it's having... <clears throat> oh, the streetlights work as well. Oh, that's perfect. I'm gonna do more of those um uh, that's rob's street lights i can i can really quickly check it here under it's called polish street lights unfortunately i only see, oh they're all here okay double-sided perfect yeah that's the one uh perfect perfect uh, they're not gonna work now but they will work later um so i can put these street lights around here uh okay i missed i didn't miss it, it it's, it's it's perfect it's absolutely stunning I can do it here and here. That's going to be nice. I'll do more. I'll do more. I think when I load it or next day, uh, they're going to work. You can see that these street lights work here. Anyway, look, I'm going to leave it here. I'm going to go and enjoy myself for the, uh, this Christmas. I hope you guys will enjoy it as well. So happy. Doesn't matter what religion you are. I wish you all the best in general. So guys, uh, have a good one. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, press the like button. You know that good stuff that we say. Like, subscribe, notification bell, ring in the comment section. Hit it. And if you want to support the channel there's always leaky's coffee there in the in patreon or i don't know like what, what merry christmas see you next one bye bye